Welcome to Easy English Practice. I married my high school sweetheart. Part 5. Lily surprises Ryan by flying to visit him for a weekend. Lily, what are you doing here? This is such a wonderful surprise. I missed you so much, Ryan. I couldn't stand the distance anymore. I just had to see you. I'm so glad you're here. Ryan, I know things have been tough with your studies and being so far away. I just want you to know that I support you. Thanks, Lily. That means a lot to me. But I know it's been hard on you too. I wish there was a way we could be together more often. I know, me too. But we can't keep living like this forever. We need to figure out a way to make it work. I agree. I don't want to lose you again. But my studies are really important to me. I can't just give up on them. I understand that, Ryan. But we can still make time for each other. Maybe we can plan more visits like this one. That's a good idea. I also want to try to make more time for you. I don't want you to feel neglected. I appreciate that, Ryan. I just want us to be happy together. I love you. I love you too, Lily. Let's work on making this work, no matter what. Ryan comes back to visit Lily but they get into a fight about his lack of commitment to their future together. Ryan walks into Lily's apartment with a bouquet of flowers and a big smile on his face. Lily rushes to give him a hug, but as she pulls away, she notices the tension in his face. What's wrong? I don't know how to say this. I've been thinking a lot about us and our future together. And I don't know if I'm ready for that kind of commitment. What are you saying, Ryan? 
Are you breaking up with me? No, no. I just need some time to figure things out. This graduate program is really demanding, and I don't want to make any promises that I can't keep. I understand that it's hard, but I can't keep waiting around for you to decide if you want to be with me or not. I need to know that you're committed to our relationship. I am committed to you, Lily. But I just can't promise that I'll be able to move back here after I finish school. I might get a job on the other side of the country or even overseas. I appreciate your honesty, Ryan. But I can't continue to be in a relationship where I don't know what the future holds. I need to know that we're in this together. I understand, Lily. I really do. I just don't know what to do. I think we need some time apart to figure things out. Maybe we can talk about this again in the future. I understand. I'm sorry, Lily. I never meant to hurt you. Lily nods, and Ryan leaves the apartment. She sinks down onto the couch, feeling heartbroken and unsure of what the future holds for her and Ryan. To be continued. Please like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates.